back to my YouTube channel. So me and Mickey have been wanting to do this video for so long. So it's now currently, I don't know, it's late at night. So I'm in my pyjamas. I'm covering my saggy boobs because I've got no bra on with my pound on back. <laughs> um, but me and Mickey done this video um, like probably nearly two years ago was probably. It two years ago, was it? Maybe. No, actually, because I've only been doing YouTube for two years. So it's definitely over a year ago since we've done this video. Right. And basically, it's a pound land... Challenge. Yes, um, gift swap challenge. But we had a budget of £5. But as all oh, you guys know, not everything's a pound and pound land anymore. Not everything's a pound and pound land anymore. Which you spot my joke. Yeah, because every time I go, I come back from Poundland, because you know, I always get really good, like, bargains. I always say to me, go, look what I got from Poundland, and he's always like... How much was that? Yeah, and it's just like, now I can say, it's it was £2. He's wearing a bit thin there, but... Yeah, but he still yeah, does anyway. it. But he needs to give us six years, and he still does this joke. Still got some goodies for, for a pound. Yeah, I've got some really good bargains. Right. Okay, so now we've kind of like had a discussion and figured out how we're going to do this. This complicated we're, yeah. video. We're going to swap our bags over. So Mickey's now going to have the things that I bought him. And I'm going to have the things he bought me. And we're going to take in turns, not looking in the bag obviously, and take one thing out. Right. But we've got meanings for behind each of these gifts. So do you want to go first or do you want me to go, go first? Go first? Okay. Right, eyes closed. <laughs> no more mess. No more mess. A compartment organiser. I've got to say, this is a bit wishful thinking on her behalf because I am messy. I've got so many drawers and cupboards, but I am messy. Yeah, but you but, yeah, always I'll find want bits it. for yeah, it. Yeah, like your screws and all things yeah. like that. Or you can keep all your little stationery in. I don't know. Yeah, no, no, I'll, I'll find bits and pieces. Yeah, I, I've I, got these all over my factory, just full up of bits and pieces. So Screws mostly. I will make use your of them. Your collection of screws. I should have bought some screws to put in there. Oh, but it's probably not the best of quality, but I thought, you know, no, no, they're the right. things you can use and, and then, yeah. yeah. No, you're good. happy with that? I'm over the moon. Okay. <laughs> okay, so now it's my go. Right, this is the first thing I've picked up. Oh, it's a DVD. The Woman in Black, Fair Her, right. Fair Her Curse. Right, I know we've seen that. Yeah. But I just thought... On one of those nights when we were looking for something to watch, that was quite a good film. Yeah, yeah. I really we, liked we it. We watched what that. Danny good... Radcliffe is really good. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with that. Thank you. There's a story behind this. That's the first time I ever went to theatre. It was to see The Woman in Black. And it was fantastic, but it was so cheaply done. We, we went together, didn't we? No, no, I did the first time I ever went to see it. It was the first time I went to the theatre. That was years ago. Oh. But and we did see this together at yeah. the theatre, didn't we? And yeah. I thought it was really good. It hasn't got any big stage effects, but they're just really clever. It really yeah. is good. If you ever get a chance to see it, it's in a theatre near you. Go and see it. It really is good. Oh, I love going to the fair. It's nothing like going to the fair, is it? Apart from the seat space isn't very good no, for your no, long legs, is it? Legs. Right. Number two. <laughs> I think these... I like every just thank you to stop me snoring. I think I've got to put these on. <laughs> you show what they are. <laughs> Actually, I did want some of these. I was yeah. looking at a YouTube video the other day and it had some of these on there and I thought, oh, do you know what, they would be useful for holding little bits and pieces. Well, I, they had some in there like They're little clamps, by the way. They're just sort of clamped. But they were like cheap. But these ones They're are by Decton strong. and they seem really good. Decton. I thought, well. One of the best. <laughs> Well, normally they just have like the Poundland brand in there, and I just thought, well. I've got a feeling if it's a pound in, in Poundland, it's probably. No, but. They... Listen, they're good. That, that, that's got, I've got loads of uses for those. Not, they always do some, um, sell actual brand things in there for a pound. That's no. how you can get some really good bargains. That's good. Thank you. Worthwhile. Okay. Good. Right. You know, it's all my presents are revolving around work, by the way. Well, it was really hard to buy stuff in there this time for you. There wasn't a lot in there because we went to like a different Poundland in. Where did we go? Can I just say something? The dogs are finding them very interesting. <laughs> Mario's down there trying to play with them. Where did we go to get this Poundland? Because it's the first one we was in Canterbury. Yeah, we went to Canterbury, and so I just said, Canterbury. "Let's go to the Poundland there and do this video." Yep. Okay, ready? Cool. That's not the. There's one really good one in here that she's okay. gonna love. That's it. She's Is got it? it? Yeah. <laughs> I saw the girls playing with this in there. <laughs> oh. 
this hopefully will stop her strangling oh me and suffocating me. Sorry, I didn't actually realise what it was for. It says, give that snore what for, for a super king size reach. Can you open it? Yeah, I didn't realise it's actually like a, a puncher thing to stop him snoring. I thought it was just like a, a stupid like little thing that you just punch people with. No. I didn't realise it was for when they snore. I am actually going to use this. because Overnight, when I'm snoring, <laughs> I'll wake up in a state because she's holding my nose and stopping me from breathing. I and don't wait, wait, hold well your I wake mouth. up angry. I don't hold your mouth as well. Did you say you put a pillow over me the other night? No, I said I felt like putting a pillow over your head. She Look, stops me breathing when I'm asleep. And one is why I wake up you know, aggressive. Like, what are you doing? Oh, it's this. Oh, it's actually just a poker or a puncher. Oh, I swear the girl in the shop, though, she had one that you press a button and it like, punches you in the face. This one's probably a little bit more better. <laughs> I can't wait to so you do realise. I don't need it to be that long because you're only <laughs> close to me in bed. I can't wait. I knew you'd like that. <laughs> I can't wait to do that to you. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm going to try out when you store it. You can't have a go at me this time because you bought it for me. <laughs> dog, dog. The, the pugs love it. Dog, I'll chew that. Look, look, look. look, look. This is what we can use when they start fighting because there's any foe, we can just bonk them on the head with this. They're all ready to set up on there. That's, I'm actually going to put that on the I knew you'd table. like that. That's so funny. Me and it, right, right. Okay. Yeah, it's your go. Number three. Twin. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dark chocolate, any chocolate. I love yeah, chocolate. Yeah, but it's oh. like apparently everyone always raves about the Poundland versions of Toblerone. But it's a dark chocolate one, Mickey. Dark chocolate. Loves no, dark dogs, chocolate. dogs are going mad. The only things I know are trying to be good, but Ugh. there's nothing Bloody like hell. a Toblerone, though. You never be. No. Should Actually, be really no. Good. How many carbs is it? Because this dark chocolate don't normally have a lot of carbs in. Let's have a look. Um, per 100 grams, it's got 50. Can I have just a little bite? I'll have a little bite instead. Oh. Oh. Mm. No, I mean, mm. Dogs love this game, it's chocolate now. Mm. What? No touching the chocolate. It's not as nice as a Toberone one though. Okay, it's my go now, isn't it? But it is chocolate. Did you just look in the bag? No, I didn't, I didn't do it. <laughs> you went into the Valentine section, <laughs> didn't this you? This looks rude in my <laughs> Boy, it is meant to be kind of rude because everyone knows that the emoji Aubergine stands for basically a man's. Told you. Yeah, doodah. This is a stress ball. Because she does get stressed. So I'm just going to say, instead of punching me in the head with the little fist, just no. chill out, babe. Just, <laughs> just squeeze your aubergine. <laughs> I'm going to be sitting, I'm going to be punching this and de stressing at the same time. Because <laughs> this is a good de stress thing for me if I could keep hitting with you with that. It says, Dr. Love says, make sure to get your five a day. Squeeze me, poke me, squash me. It says, hashtag to be blessed, to be stressed. They'll probably find me dead in bed with this wedged in my throat when I've been snoring. <laughs> you got me some really good things. Right. Um, me? Is it me? Yeah, it's your love. Right, right. Ah, oh, football insult. I've recently moved into a new factory, right? It is the coldest place on earth. As you open the door, the light comes on. It is like a fridge in there. So these would be good. Yeah, good. My poor feet are so really cold over there. <laughs> I got him loads of like thermal stuff for Christmas. And obviously when we're going to panel, I know it's only like a silly video, but I wanted to get things no. that could actually use. And I saw them and I was like, oh my goodness. I'll let you know if they're any good. It says stays up, stays warm for up to eight well, hours. Well, we'll see, but I, I get such cold feet in this new factory. So I think you can only use them once. Yeah, I would imagine. Um, you know. But you'll have to save them for a day when it's really, really cold. It's really cold over there every day. Okay, <laughs> is this the alone. last thing? No, you've got One, two, two, you've got two more. Three. Okay. Gracie. Gracie's now eating the foot warmers. That's because they think they're treats. Okay, I've got something that feels fabric-y. All right. Right. <laughs> no, there is a reason for this. <laughs> When you're doing the cross trainer, yeah, and you get start getting little blistery things on your hand, so <laughs> I was thinking of your hands. <laughs> I always take the Mickey out of Mickey because he actually has some like 
gym gloves like this. When I walk into the gym, he wears like these cheap trainers which look like granny oh, no, trainers with these proper, right. socks. And then it's proper sexy. Yeah, and then he always have these gloves on and always come in and go, "Oh babe, you look and proper fine today." But when you're doing weights with the bar, it, I've got rough hands anyway. It just gives you little blisters, little calluses across your hands. So when you're on the trainer, on the cross trainer now, you won't get little blisters. <laughs> it's so random though, but actually, yeah, because I'm, I'm oh, oh, it's geez, some padding. You're pretty I'm, stuck for ideas in part pair. To be fair. Def not wearing these on a bike. No, they're for like, when you're on a cross trainer. Because yeah, cross no, trainer. yeah, I'll, I'll wear these on a cross trainer. Right, my last one. Oh, there's sorry, there's two things in there, but that's something I bought for myself. It's heavy. Oh, Epsom salts. Yeah. I love a bath some nights after work. If I don't have a shower, I have a nice little hot bath and. Epsom salts are quite good to have in there. They're so. good for muscles. I think I got you the one for muscles. Is that muscles? Right, so that'll be great. I didn't see them. Yeah, this one's for muscles. So that'd be nice. Good for you. I do like a nice steaming hot bath some nights. I mean, like, I sometimes get in the bath after and just like save water, and sometimes it is. Well, you scream tonight, you too, really. Yeah, yeah, I have to put cold water in. Don't um, fight over the Yes, because they know like the chocolate's there, so they're getting a bit protective. Okay. On, last in one. my last one. Last one. Oh no, it's a receipt. I don't know why. I oh. thought I could smell something like scented. <laughs> I thought it was just me. Oh, you know I love my pearl oh, no, fresheners. These are actually really good value for money. Two for a pound. Mm, they smell really good as well. Citrus zest. These are actually, I think, these last really long, these kind of like air fresheners. I'll get them out and show which ones to get. But these ones like this in the tin, they last forever. And yeah, there's two in a pack. That's a really good bargain. Um, I, I can't like wait. Yeah, I feel like it's always nice to have, when you get into your car and it smells nice. Thank you. You've got me some actually some really funny things and some like things that obviously are really useful. really handy. Well, actually, the this is going to be super useful. I knew you'd like. It. <laughs> that was so good. You know, Charlie, when you, I think I had a sharp edge as well. <laughs> So. I'm going to use the sharp edge when he's really like getting on my nerves. It should have had the spring in it though, so that's it went out and boing. I swear I saw the girl had one that she pressed because I saw it shoot out. Mario's down there and he's looking at this. Boom. <laughs> So oh, anyway, that's the end of our video. I hope you did enjoy it. If you want us to do another kind of like um, gift swap video like this, maybe we could switch up the challenge. I've done this video with Leanne, but we've done only pink. So maybe we could do like a, only like a certain colour or only buy things with a certain like letter, beginning of a letter or something. I'm going to regret that. Yeah, <laughs> I'm taking this to bed tonight. But yeah, anyway, guys, um, comment down below if you'd like us to do this maybe in a different store. Um, yeah. Yeah, give us some guys. ideas because we're, we're running out of ideas. Yeah, we, we love your ideas and any kind of like suggestions would all be very helpful. Anyway, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And also, if you're new to my channel and you haven't already, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And we'll see you in another video very soon. Bye. See ya. Bye.